Len Nevin here with Loyalty Home Group at EXP Realty. I wanted to give you all an update of what we saw. There was this Hurricane Hillary that came up through the West Coast, through the Baja of California, and I wanted to get you guys an update for those who are wondering, how did we survive? Now, I just want to make a full disclosure. I'm in Gilbert, which is in the East Valley. Um, I don't know how things look on the West Valley. I can only account for what I see with my own two eyes, and pretty much what I can attest to is there was really not much. I don't know how windy it got. I haven't read the news on it, but I look around and all I saw was a few Palo Verde that fallen over. In all honesty, our monsoons are crazier and have stronger winds and have tougher rains and cause more damage than Hillary did here, at least in the East Valley. So I can't speak to California, I can't say Hillary's a total dud across the board. All I can speak to is what I see here in the East Valley. And for us, it was a whole bunch of nada. So one of the beautiful things I love about high, you know, any winds, any rain, is it starts to clear out the skies. And you know, we live in a valley, right? So there's mountains on either side of us. And what ends up happening is all the cars and everything that drives by, it just collects all this smog and so when you don't get a lot of rain week after week after week after week after week day after day month after month you start to see just this kind of collective um smog right this collective smoke that just sits in the air and the beautiful thing about a little bit of rain is it clears things up so i'm gonna throw the drone up here in a minute and kind of show you what i mean by it and you could still see some rain clouds off to the over here but we're starting to see some clear skies over there and you're starting to see like the superstitions are starting to come alive. Um, you can see them a little bit more clearly than you normally would had we not gotten any rain. So just to give you an update, that's where we're at. Reach out if you have any real estate related questions. We're here to help. So if this is your first time to our channel, make sure you like, subscribe, and of course, ring that bell for more information related to the East Valley, the real estate market, what's going on in the market, um, East Valley, Phoenix, West Valley, anywhere in, uh, you know, in the, the Arizona area. So, you know, we're living here in Arizona. Um, as you look through the skies, you can see, you know, we're here in Gilbert, Val Vista Lakes. The lakes are looking beautiful. Um, you know, we just see rain kind of covering the entire area here and it's clearing up here to the east so you can start seeing and this is what i love about the rain it clears all the pollution and clears that all away and we can now see the superstition spring or sorry the superstition mountains um, and it just looks really clear obviously you know it's a little bit too cloudy for us to really be able to see four peaks right here but you know as we continue to look through it's just you know a little bit of rain cloudiness it's a really just a light drizzle right now as we're looking. So it's not a lot of, um, you know, not a lot of downpour. The wind is gone. We only had a few knocked over trees. As you can see, all the trees are standing here. You know, they, they survived. So we didn't really have those winds and anything that we were looking for. Um, you know, the thing about what I find here is that, in my opinion, after yesterday and looking at this, is our monsoons really do more damage than we got here with the, you know, the kind of the tail end or the furthest outreaches of this Hurricane Hillary that pushed through, um, which we don't get a lot of hurricanes that hit the Pacific. So that was kind of news for us. So anyways, um, like I said, reach out with any questions. Uh, we're here to help. We'll check you next time.